Ah, oh, what a find. I tell you what, if I'd have dug them up, I'd have probably just thought they were fence <laughs> yeah, posts and put them back yeah. again. So <laughs> fair play to them. Um, now, um, Sarah's here with your weather. Um, it's obviously, you know, we've had some pretty heavy rain today. Nothing like what's happening elsewhere. No. But are we going to write off the weekend or not? No, we're not. Saturday, yes, there'll be some showers. Sunday's looking a little brighter. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from today, though. We've had some gorgeous photos. This viewpoint here at Lake Beach on the Isle of Wight is one of them. Thank you to Sarah Pointer. Beautiful autumn colour here on the Basingstoke Canal near Odium. That picture taken by Steve Lavender. Thanks, Steve. And blue skies reflecting here on Setley Pond, courtesy of Julia Rosser. Thank you for that. Well, we've seen a pretty typical autumnal day today. Blue skies and sunshine one moment, followed by some heavy downpours the next. And we've got a few more of those sharp showers in store for us through the coming 24 hours before things do settle down towards the tail end of the weekend. But it will be blustery at times, particularly along the coast. So through this evening, initially lots of us seeing quite dry conditions, but gradually we'll see more of those showers arriving from the south and they've got the potential to be rather hefty, maybe slow moving too. Temperatures holding at around 9 or 10 degrees through the overnight spell and quite breezy too. So that's the start of our weekend. Saturday begins on a bit of a blustery note with more of those showers. They do gradually track eastwards, but you can see they crop up just about everywhere. So we could all see some heavy downpours during the day on Saturday. There will be some brighter intervals either side and it's set to be blustery, particularly through coastal stretches. Here we could see those winds gusting at around 40 miles per hour. So let's take a look then at your inshore waters for Celsi Bill to Lyme Regis, valid from midday tomorrow through until midday on Sunday. The winds will be cyclonic four to six, becoming west or northwesterly five to seven occasionally gale eight a very blustery day to be out on the water so through the evening period gradually we do see things calming down so eventually the overnight spell looks to be largely dry with clear skies perhaps some mist in the picture as the winds ease off as well we do just have this cluster of showery weather which may just affect the southwestern part of our region overnight temperatures down to around six or seven degrees so a cooler night to come that area of low pressure is easing away through the day on Sunday, so we're in store for calmer conditions courtesy of this ridge, which will bring us largely clear skies through the day on Sunday. It does mean we'll have plenty of sunshine, maybe with some cloud and some showers later. Let's take a look at the outlook then for the next few days. And as you can see, it looks like Sunday will be the better, drier, brighter day of the weekend. Monday will be a cloudy start with perhaps some rain developing later on. Well, there you go. <laughs> that is uh, it from us for the time being. Uh, thank you for watching. David Allard has your late bulletin at half past ten tonight. Uh, in the meantime, though, from all of us here, have a very good evening. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye.